What's up? This is Squire2448 with a Farming Simulator 17 video. Today we'll be doing some multiplayer lawn care. What's up everyone? Today we'll be using the Chevy 2500 Dually with the enclosed trailer and we'll be using the John Deere Zero Turn and the Walker Mower. And I'll be using this Chevy over here. Yep, so let's hop in our trucks, turn them on, and we'll head out here from the lawn care shop, and we'll be mowing the Country Club, which is one of our largest commercial properties. So we'll pull out here, and since this truck does not have the passenger script, he does have to take another vehicle. But it's pretty cool how we have matching green trucks, and we did get a lot of requests to use this Chevy Dually for the lawn care. So let us know down below in the comments, guys. Should we have all of the trucks this dark green? Green. I think this dark green looks pretty cool, but this 25 foot enclosed trailer looks pretty well on the back and it's actually making the truck uh, lower in the back if you would say. So we'll continue down here. We are passing by the airport and stay tuned for tomorrow at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time where we are releasing this map. So it's going to be a lot of fun. We'll be continuing down here and probably start off mowing the front of the country club and then move to the back. Alright, so we arrived here, so if you want to pull into a parking spot, I'll just pull up along the building. And this is, like I was saying, a large property, and a lot of people come here that own properties around the map, so we do have to do a really good job. So I lower the ramps, and when you do lower the ramps on this trailer, you cannot actually lower it all the way when using this dually, or else the front of this truck will go down, and the back will go down. So you just have to go just enough, but we'll hop in the 52-inch walker mower. And I will be starting on the left side, so can you start on the right? Yep. Awesome, so we'll get started here. I will first mow up against the fence line, and I'm going to be very careful, making sure that we do not hit the fence, but I do not have to worry about staining the fence with any grass, because the walker is a built-in bagging system, so we'll probably stay a pretty realistic distance away. Yeah, and we have also have to be uh, careful about these signs. Yeah, there's also signs around. So I hope you guys are enjoying these videos, and let us know down below in the comments, guys, what other types of multiplayer videos would you guys like me to do on the channel? And we'll be doing the back, but I really want to do the front yard area. That way we can do some really nice striping and everything like that. But I would like to thank you all for the continued support on the daily content. We are getting closer and closer to 50,000 subscribers. That's going to be a pretty epic uh, 50k special coming to you guys and I really appreciate each and every one of you subscribing and supporting the channel. How do you like your John Deere? Yeah, I love this John Deere. Um, it actually turns a very nice. Yeah, it's a great mower. So, uh, looks like you are doing much faster, but you do have a pretty large deck. I have a 52 and I believe you have a deck somewhere in the 70s. I believe it's a 72 inch on that. So you have a pretty big mower deco on yours. You should be able to finish uh, faster, which I did actually give you the larger uh, area also. Yeah, this thing's a lot bigger and it can get the job done faster, which is uh, great. Yeah, so it looks like I just got almost half of this front yard done. But I mean, this is, like I was saying, one of the largest uh, commercial properties on this, other than a few different ones like the police station that has a giant backyard. But I'm very excited to be releasing this map to you guys as a beta. Now this map will not have working traffic or any spawn vehicles to start out, but I will be doing a later version, but you guys have been asking for a version how it was. So we'll be doing a mod release video tomorrow. I'm laying down some really nice stripes right now. I'm trying to do mainly some three point turns, try not to uh, damage the turf. Yeah, it's really difficult mowing around these trees because um, it's kind of hard to see through the leaves uh, also. Yeah, we might have to hire the tree services company to come by and trim these branches because I'm also uh, having to dodge them with my head because they are just so low to the ground. So it looks like I'm just about finishing the front area over here. How are you doing over there? 
Yep, I'm a little bit uh, over halfway down on this side. Awesome, so if you want to continue, I will actually come over and help you out, kind of finish up the last little section before we start on the back area. But the back of this is going to be a pretty large location. Well, take a look at that, you are just almost done. So I will probably start going up against the fence line, preparing uh, to do the back. So I will probably be doing that as you finish up over there. You did some very nice stripes, as I can see with your tire tracks. And a uh, little sections like right here, I will be updating before tomorrow. That way you guys can mow all of this. And I believe that there's also some sections in the back where we do need to do a little bit of grass work with. Yeah, just a little bit back here. Yeah, it's uh, pretty difficult mowing next to this fence because um, you could kind of get stuck on it. So you got to be very careful. Yeah, if you can uh, just get that little pass there, come out back here. And they actually have a very large swimming pool. So take a look at that, guys. And I think we'll probably stop here in a few minutes and actually take a look at it. But we are unable to kind of squeeze by there. I might go and uh, kind of work on that and I do have to work on that right there I mean that's a pretty dangerous section so like I was saying there's just a few bugs that will be worked out but we'll kind of hop out of here and you guys can see that I actually put water in here take a look at this they have a full uh, in-ground swimming pool with water that's a pretty cool feature that I wanted to add because some swimming pools in farms and do not actually have the water but I really wanted it for this map yeah it looks great yeah, so I'm going to do this little patch in front. We'll do over here and then we'll go to the other side. But we should be able to finish up today, load up, and actually head back to the shop. That's going to be awesome. Yeah, uh, you can get these uh, lawns done very fast with the larger mowers. Yep, I'm coming over here to help on this side. The faster we get this done, the more efficient we could be mowing more lawns and everything like that. So, I mean, this back section, we do not have to worry about striping like we did on the front but we'll just kind of get it mowed now you guys can see that this walker mower actually has five wheels and I really do like the design of it it has a built-in bagger system which means that it has like a vacuum and it uh, vacuums up all the grass clippings built in so if you want to come way over here we'll kind of finish up this little side section and then we'll call it a day take a look at that John Deere guys it looks like it's almost faster than this walker which is probably right but you guys can see I do have some work here with that giant uh, area that uh, I had to kind of make the whole quiz swimming pool with but this area is actually larger than I was thinking so uh, this will probably take us rest of today yeah the, uh, this is a very big lawn once we outline this area with the fence and everything like that it's going to be a little bit easier but that little section there we do have to uh, get the weed eater for so we'll kind of do that but I'll kind of go around the fence line if you just want to start going around and uh, doing the nice stripes yeah so take a look at that guys he's already starting and that is one fast mower that's awesome we really do like to do it and just about almost got stuck there this walker was not wanting to stop there for a minute but you guys can see we are mowing up close to this fence as close as we can and I mean with the walker like I was saying earlier we do not have to worry about uh, damaging the fence with grass stains but I hope you guys are enjoying today's video and uh, always have a great day I really do enjoy doing daily farm soon videos these are a lot of fun and I really also do like doing these multiplayer videos because these are a lot of fun. So you already got that section almost done. So I'll work on this section over here. Now this mower is mowing very fast. But let us know down below in the comments guys. Should we start on another big project for the channel? I'm thinking that we might start on like a farm town map with a lot of farm fields, have a lot of hills. So let me know your thoughts, guys. Should we start building another map since this one is going to be released as a beta? I think that would be pretty cool to do. Look at that, guys. Look, he's already passing us, and uh, he's mowing pretty top speeds right there. So that's very interesting that uh, the John Deere is a lot faster than the Walker.
Yeah, so if you just want to get that section right over there, we'll head back to the trucking trailer. We'll actually load up. I will be parking the walker in first. And with this enclosed trailer, we could just leave the mowers inside. We do not have to unload anything like that, which is very helpful. But when you do uh, kind of pull up here, your front tires might go up in there. It looks like mine did not, which was good. But just pull in and we'll uh, get this trailer turned around and head back. Watch him load up. Look at that, guys. That's a pretty cool mower. Now, I will be adjusting the height of this trailer, making it a little bit higher for that. But this was the first mod release I ever did, this enclosed trailer, and you guys really did enjoy it. So we'll be doing more mod releases. I do plan on getting some uh, models and everything like that. But if you want to uh, lead us back to the shop, that will be good. Yep, you are clear of my truck. Yes, yeah, so we'll pull out here, we'll head back to the lawn care shop, and I mean, driving around this map is a pretty realistic uh, time, and I actually did make the roads really wide. You guys can see that this truck and trailer are fitting really well on this map, even this trailer, which is, I believe, an 8 foot wide trailer, so that's a pretty large trailer, but uh, we will actually be using the backup camera on this truck to back into the lawn care shop parking area, which earlier in the week we did turn into asphalt which was a pretty cool video if you guys haven't checked that out i do recommend you to we'll probably be doing an upgrade video adding this uh truck and trading out the other chevy but once we uh kind of pull in here we'll be calling it a day so if you want to pull in leave some room and i will uh, be backing in the trailer now take a look at this guys, we have a backup camera here which is a very cool feature. So we'll kind of turn around and back in. Awesome, so I hope you guys enjoyed today's lawn care video. Thanks for watching, have a great day and subscribe for more.